Small Montana towns often made up of dedicated, community-driven people. And as Q2's Jenny Vick shows us in our final One School at a Time contest this school year, that small town strength brings in the top prize. On behalf of Cloud Peak Energy and Q2, we would like to present Pineview Elementary with the award-winning $2,000 for the One School at a Time Challenge. Congratulations. <laughs> The whole community just rallied behind us to make sure that we got what we needed, which is just a true testament for the town of Colstrip. When, when things are in need or when someone needs support, the entire community just backs us up. Schools are always in need of something new, um, something that they can't afford with the budgets they are given. And one of the unique opportunities is this, it not only gets those schools those those items that perhaps they wouldn't have been able to, but um, it really rallies the community, the, the parents in that school district to, to get together and whether it's voting or add their own contributions, um, it helps the school out in multiple ways. Nearly $30,000 in grants donated to area schools. That marks the end of a year of great projects. In Colstrip, Jenny Fick, MTN News. Westside Elementary in Sydney will receive $1,000 to purchase clay and pottery materials. And third place Yellowstone Academy here in Billings wins $500 to purchase supplies for its summer arts program. Speaking of summer, we have a little homework for you over summer vacation. Don't forget, we'd like you to nominate schools, classes, and teachers that could benefit from Q2 and Cloud Peak Energy's One School at a Time grant. You'll have the whole summer to think about that. Our grant competition kicks up again this fall once the new school year gets underway.